Hi, it's Margaret from Let's Learn to Sew, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to use a magnetic seam guide. Let's zoom in and take a look at the throat plate area of our sewing machine. Now I know that when you first begin to sew, and even depending on your eyesight, these little tiny lines can be very intimidating. The idea of having to line up your piece of fabric, begin sewing, and keep it lined up the entire seam can be a little intimidating. Not to worry, there's a few tricks that we can use to make it a lot easier. The first tool I'm going to show you how to use to keep your seam straight is a magnetic seam guide. I do have another video that shows you how to use tape if you prefer to do that. And what a magnetic seam guide is, is it's just a metal guide that you line up on your needle plate of your machine and on the back side it has a magnet that makes it stick. According to the instructions that come with the magnetic seam guide, it is safe to use on electronic machines. I've been using it on several of my machines and at the schools that I teach in, and we've not had a problem yet. However, you do want to check with your owner's manual or with the, your sewing machine manufacturer to make sure it's safe for your electronic machine. What we're going to do is we're going to take the magnetic seam guide, we're going to line it up with our mark. In this case, we're doing a 5 8 seam allowance, and we're going to butt it up just against the 5 8 mark, making sure that we keep it straight. And you can line this up along any of these lines all the way up until the edge of the metal. Now, this is going to be a lot easier to line up with than just the line. We're going to begin and place our fabric in there, line it up. Do our back stitch and then begin sewing. The entire time we're just lining up the edge of the fabric with the edge of that guide. Go ahead and lift your presser foot and remove your fabric the way you normally would. That's all there is to using a magnetic seam guide. If you have any questions about using this, be sure to let me know and I'm happy to help. 